might uh, might have us uh, an answer here. Look back in the distance. Oh, clunk right there. Teammates. Let's see, yeah. Oh if, man, yeah. I'll tell you, that's if definitely needed hard. Both getting into the wall a little bit. Oh, oh and David Reagan. And another and the teammate. caution's out. Oh, my Caution goodness. Out, Hang on. Fired up and roll. Got rear damage, rear damage. Yeah, a lot of rear damage. That's not a good place to be sitting sideways across the racetrack. Not a good place to be sitting in. Uh, he was in the battle for... Need, uh, four tires. Uh, just backed it straight back into the wall. Now they got a lot of damage to fix here. This is not going to be a quick fix. Yeah, he has that win from Daytona that had him in contention for a chase spot, but this is going to severely hamper that. You see the car being pushed on pit road. That is Brian Vickers' car being pushed toward the opening of the garage. We'll follow up and get you an explanation on that in a second. Casey Mears got a pass-through penalty. Told you he made a pit stop as the field was taking the green. He got a pass-through penalty for a pit road violation and had to come back. Now let's see what happened to David Reagan. Right, he's just a little aggressive underneath Rudeman. Getting yeah. into the bumps. He's the one that paid the price, though. Yeah, and that's a, you, know, you, you know that that's down there, and that's a price. You, at this point in time of the race, these guys are already too wide, making it three wide there. I don't. It looked like David Rudeman had no idea he was there. Now look, we were just talking about give and take early in the race, yeah. but that was a lot of taking from Reagan. 